how to fix Fortnite and update is required to continue, please restart Fortnite to download the latest patch. So if you're facing this problem in PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5, here is a video where I'll show you some simple steps in order to fix this problem. First and foremost, switch off your console completely. Unplug the power cable from the console and wait for 2-3 to three minutes. Now hold the power button when the console is off until any remaining power is left and then plug your power cable back to turn it on. This will also clear your cache data automatically from the system. Next step, what you can do is so you have to rebuild database in your PlayStation 5. For this, what you have to do is you have to turn off your PlayStation 5 by pressing hold the power button until you hear two beeps and wait for 30 seconds. Plug the power code back. This will also clear your cache and then connect your PS5 into it and it will boot up into the safe mode when you're holding the power button. You have to select the option number 5 which says rebuild database from a safe mode menu, wait for the process to complete, then restart your PS5 manually and then try the game, see if that helps. Next step would be to disable HDCP. For this, head over to the PS5 settings, choose system and then select HDMI tab. Now turn off the toggle saying enable HDCP. Next step. It may happen that you're getting this issue because of some network bug. So simply change the network. If by chance you're using a Wi-Fi or a LAN cable from a particular ISP, try changing it to your mobile hotspot. Simply turn on the hotspot, connect your Wi-Fi, then try to sign in in your game, see if that helps. Last step would be to change your DNS server manually. For this, in your PlayStation home screen, go to the settings, select network, Choose set up internet connection. Select your internet connection type and pick the connection from the list. When prompted to choose how you want to set your internet connection, you have to select custom. Select automatic for your IP address settings and select do not specify for a DHCP host name. In the DNS settings, select manual. Now you have to enter the primary DNS as 1111 and the secondary DNS would be 1001. This is a Cloudflare DNS which is much more stable than the public Google DNS server. If you want the Google DNS server, you can choose that which is 8888-8844. After that, for the proxy server, you have to choose do not use. Once you are done, Test the connection, log in into your game, see if you're getting the error. I'm pretty sure it will be fixed. So that was a video on how to fix this problem on PlayStation and PlayStation 5. If you're having this issue, do put down in the comment section. If this video helped you, please don't forget to like button, consider subscribing to my channel if you're new here. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.